All right, hey, I just uh, I had somebody just ask me uh, here in Hallbrook if they should go ahead and put their house on the market uh, because it's getting towards the end of the year. And, uh, you know, what I tell people is October and November here in Kansas City is a couple of months that uh, the city shows really well. You know, the foliage changes and usually we've had quite a bit of rain and everything greens up. So I kind of tell people to go ahead and dip your toe in the water, give it a couple of months from uh, beginning of October till maybe Thanksgiving time, and maybe we can kind of sort through and see exactly how the market's going to respond to your house. Hopefully we'll get it sold. There might be that flyer uh, looking to be in Hallbrook. In addition to that, you know, you've got a couple months on the market, you're going to be able to sort through some data that uh, will allow you use that in the spring market uh, you kind of that's when the market will really pick up and then you'll be off the market long enough to have a new days on market in the spring but Shine your light. anyway these ground the grounds here as I said this time of year in Kansas City is beautiful We've got great rains, the, the vegetation is lush. This place is really cool. I got my brochure for my client um, and it confirms what I already know. We used to spend Easter Sundays here with uh, my kids when they were little. Um, uh, what a great place. They've got a fantastic chef. Uh, the clubhouse is second to none. They've got a fantastic golf course, tennis courts, pool. Hey, so to wrap it up, we're here in Hallbrook, and again, I've asked, somebody's called me to ask me, you know, hey, should I put my house on the market? Go ahead, but in all honesty, the market does tend to slow down in the fall months. Kansas City looks great in the fall. Hey, let's gra gather some data for these two months if we don't sell, and then you'll be prepared for the spring market to potentially get you higher value.